With this weather news update, for Frank Phillips, I'm Jill Purcell. Paper News 24-7 is brought to you by Workforce Plus. Whether you're looking for work or need workers, Workforce Plus can help. Call Workforce Plus today at 364-9675. I'm going to go ahead and update the closings, cancellations, that we do have a few things that are open. IU Bloomington classes will resume this afternoon. Um, Purdue University classes and most operations are closed today. Wabash College is open. The classes are left up to the discretion of each professor, so you're just going to have to check to see if your class is on schedule. And PNC Bank is now open. Okay, thank you, Jill. It is a snowy mess out there. Looking outside our window, we can see the uh, snow blowing horizontal across the street. And uh, the county is under a snow emergency. That means that the uh, county commissioners got together last night and decided to declare a snow emergency. That means that you are encouraged to stay off all county roads, stay off all county roads, now that does not apply to the city of Crawfordsville. It does not apply to uh, state and uh, highways and the interstate. However, we are told that road conditions are terrible across the region. So use your own judgment. Uh, and uh, if you have closings, please let us know by calling us here at the paper, 361-0100, extension 10, 361-0100, extension 10. Or you can send an email to F. Phillips, that's F is in Frank Phillips with two L's, at the paper, the number 24-7.com. And earlier today, we talked to Phil Good, manager of CELNP, who gave us some information about uh, how uh, CELNP customers fared last night, and also gave us some tips. How has things gone overnight to last night? We had two outages over the night, uh, minor outages uh, caused by the high winds and the uh, ice. Uh, we only had three customers out overnight. We're in pretty good shape. Our big concern today is, is we Duke feed into Montgomery County, the south feed to go into Cuyahoga Power Plant is out, so we don't have any redundant feed into Montgomery County at this time. They uh, say they're working on it, uh, but with the high winds and stuff, uh, So we are seeing ice on the transmission lines in your ter territory? Uh, southern Montgomery County and on into Park County and Vigo County, uh, we've got more ice than what we got here. It seems that we got more sleep, which was a blessing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because as you and I were talking yesterday, you said that uh, the sleet does not accumulate on lines, but you said that the uh, rain would. Yes, yes. Uh, and uh, we can, we build our Okay, and I think Jill had a question uh, about uh, how people ought to uh, take care of their electronic equipment during storms. Yeah, yeah good morning, Phil. Um, Hi, Jill, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. I got a question. You know, I had a caller call in and say, you know, that their electricity is dimming on and off. And is it really hard on your electronics, on your TVs and, you know, your furnaces? Should you shut them off? Should you unplug them? What's the safest thing to do? Safest thing to do is to unplug them, Jill. Uh, that is very hard on electronic equipment. Thanks, Phil. And uh, we're back. Uh, Rick Holtz of the paper was out earlier today and uh, decided to uh, experience who's your weather firsthand. Rick? Thanks, Frank. As you can see, I'm, I'm standing out here on the corner of uh, 231 and Market Street. And as you can see, there are more people out and about now. There are more cars on the road, and there are even a few businesses opening. Uh, you can check for a full list of closings and delays. You can always check the paper's website at thepaper247.com. Back to you. Okay, Rick. Well, stay warm out there, won't you? So, the thing to do is to call ahead if you're wondering if something is open. If you're... Uh, Sure, it is uh, closed, then enjoy being inside. And uh, if you don't have to get out, then the police are telling us that you should stay inside at least through today because the winds will continue to blow. 
Uh, not much more snow is expected, but uh, winds do cause drifting across roads and uh, uh, also cause problems for power lines. For Jill Purcell, I'm Frank Phillips. Be good to your neighbor. Paper News 24-7 is brought to you by Workforce Plus.